pretty uh, old school melee. Not old school, but he played melee. Yeah. Back in the day. He also played uh, Falcon March, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, he's on Shulk, our second best player. Yep. Number much. two in SoCal. Yeah. Only behind Void himself. It's looking like, at least for the next season, it's looking like it's just going to be a repeat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. They're both playing really well this season. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I've I've talked to Nico about this matchup. He thinks Shulk wins. That's because he can get out of a lot of uh, English stuff like that. Yeah, that jab is normally way more uh, punishing. Yeah. And I wonder, you know, Swedish being a melee player, Shulk is definitely a character where you need a lot of matchup experience because he has a lot of, like, corny Char stuff. Yeah, <laughs> character-specific things. Like, if you're not used to his uh, arts, Monado arts, like, you're just like, what is happening? Yeah. I feel like a lot of people, when they play a good show for the first time, like, 50% of the match is figuring out what everything does, yeah. and not necessarily just, like, how the player is playing. Man, Buster at the Legends oh. is so good. Like, you take so much shield stun and kind of block, and then, like, oh, there's oh, dang, the cheese. That, that's gross. Was that down throw air slash? It was Buster down throw into air slash. Oh, so it... Buster down throw, it doesn't do as much uh, knockback. You're right. But so then he exited Buster, and it was regular air oh, slash kills. Wow. That's actually really crazy they can yeah. do that consistently. Yeah. I believe um, what it was is that Buster was running out. There's a way where you can do it where you can manually do it, but I think Buster was just running out. So right. it just happened to happen. Oh, man. You got Smash Art 4 there. Really deep off stage. Oh, yeah, yeah, that air slash. So good at covering that angle. That's so good. It is so good. Because a lot of characters, they don't have an option against that. Yeah. Air slash's range is so big that you can't, like, you can't challenge it. Yeah, English recovery is some of the best in the game, but being able to neutralize it like that is really good for Shulk. Yeah. Especially the angle it goes at. Oh, oh, oh Carried the splat bomb in his face, but that'll do it. No. Oh, or not? Dang. Shulk every time I thought. I thought he would get like a slight charge on the Oh, no. Oh. If that second 40 ever hit, he was probably dead. Yeah. I feel like Nico would just up the, up the end. Ooh, oh. the running up to the speed art? That's clean. He gets the added, added movement. But Nico's feeling himself, man. I know it way too well. We play it so much. It, nice. it literally looks like he's unstoppable. Yeah, Shulk's a really strong character in this game, too, so it just helps him out so much. Okay, All right, the jump. Nice positioning here. He's still keeping him at the corner of the stage, but that's going to be a free roller. Not going to get anything off of it, though. Yeah. Oh, he just falls on top of him. Why not? Smash our fair kills so early, dude. Yeah. It really does show. I think I don't know if Swedish like knows what to do against all the arts. Because yeah. you have to, you have to have certain game plans against all the arts. Like against other characters, you could afford to take a hit, but like against Shulk, you have to know when it's not worth it to take a hit. Like when yeah. he's in Buster, he should run. not be like contesting him a lot. <laughs> just just you know? run, dude! I run away. Yeah. <laughs> I don't when care. When he's in Smash, like there's certain percents where it's really not worth it. Yeah. Fighting. Yeah, Buster is, is scary because you, you want to run, but you also putting yourself in the corner versus yeah. Buster. So you're like, oh, wait, I have to maneuver around the Buster, and if I shield, I have extra shield stun because of the added knockback. That's why it's so hard. Or the added damage. Yeah. But I think something that he can do, uh, Swedish that is, is that if he gets a lot of ink on Nico, he can do a lot of percent, especially if he's in Buster, because he'll be taking the Buster damage plus the ink damage. Yeah, that's true. Oh man, no, going super no. deep off stage. You're just swinging for the heavens, man. <laughs> Why not? What is he going to do to contest that hitbox? Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Oh, oh no. he's so far off stage. Uh, he's gone. He, he could have lived if he roller up these. Yeah, roller up these. Dang. That was a zero to death for Nico. He literally just harassed him off stage and said, You can't come back. You don't get to play. Is he going to get to play at all this game? Okay, he, he, got, oh. he got some percent. Okay, what's the edge guard here? Nice, catching the roll. Oh, but there's the, yeah. <laughs> the shield dart. Like, yeah, you don't get these low percent combos you're used to, man. It's actually ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, I, I can definitely see how Shulk does well in this matchup. Just from that factor alone. England gets a lot of its percent off of, like, these jabs and, like, throw combos. But the uh, shield dart just neutralizes those really well. Yeah. Okay, I'll get back. He goes so good at ledge trapping. Yeah, that's one of his best traits. And, like, he abuses it really well with Shulk. It's like, it's a, it's a bit different than, let's say, Larry ledge trapping. Larry will, like, straight up just hit you for doing it with an option. Ooh. But Nico will keep you there for a while. Even if it's not straight up hitting you, you'll feel like I'm cornered in the pressure. Like, I can't do anything. Yeah. Okay. okay. 
Beach all stage. He's safe with the jump, though, and using the jump art to get some extra aerial mobility to get to the ledge. Really smart recovery from Nico. Yeah, down to that shield. That's a really free roller to punish. Yeah. Okay, one, there we go. One thing I think Shoal can also do is if he's in the ground, um, he can't he can't change arts while he's in the ground, but if uh, if Inkling goes for an up smash, you can shield on the first hit of up smash. Oh, this, the multi-hit lets him yeah. shield the first part? Yeah. Uh, that's so in that a, case, you want to up smash. But uh, it's not looking like we're going to get to that point. <laughs> yeah, he, Nico's really working with this lead really well. Yeah. Oh, hit the ground. Oh, uh, yeah, he's a little too slow, yeah. So, Swedish is not a bad ultimate player at all, but he ran into, like, probably the worst person that uh, ultimate yeah, player right? could play. Like, I feel like he could have actually done a lot of damage to any other of our PR players. Yeah. But it's just one, that matchup, two, Nico's literally our second best player. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And